Okay, we're live. We're doing a quick demo on the, our water vac, and we've got a few of these units just here in the Bay Area, um, which allows us to respond a lot quicker. We can pull a lot more water than like a standard carpet mount or portable. And so we're able to pull 500 gallons per, um, per dump. And I'm just gonna do a quick run through of how the unit works. Right now we're actually prepping it because it was on a job all night last night doing a hazmat spill cleanup and containerizing, which we'll also do another segment on how to containerize um, post hazmat. So anyways, as you can see we've got our hoses. Let's go on this side. Pretty simple. Same deal, we've got the wands, but I we go with a... Uh, what is this, a two, two inch, three inch? So we go with a two inch um, all the way to the head. And then we've got our hoses. So they're set up so we can do a quick hose deployment. Um, and then I've got everything set up with quick connects, right? So we can match her how much hose we actually need. The quick connects actually go in. So they come into this side. So this is our suction. I'll actually fire it up in a minute here. So if we're just running one hose, then we've got all our cam fittings, one hose fits in, but then we've also, we can run three hoses. Now, having the pump ahead of the vacuum, uh, the tank, <clears throat> creates enough pressure. So we're getting, we get a thousand CFM, even, at, even when our hoses are strung out 600 feet, three hoses. So that's what allows us to be able to pull just a much higher volume of water than standard carpet mount. Um, in my closed group, I talk a lot more on how to, how to set up the fittings, uh, the manufacturers, and then I also sell these retrofit kits. So all this is a ditch winch FX60. You can rent them from United Rents, wherever. Um, and then we, we custom built the retrofit kit for the reels and then all the cam lock fittings. Um, yep. Stuff? Yeah. So let's fire it up. So we'll show you fired up. Like if we get into a crawl space where there's a lot of mud, a lot of um, larger, larger chunks, sewage. Uh, then basically, I just go from the back. We open the back up and then we dump. Followers? Double? Yeah. So this allows us. So this allows us to, you know, on a standard carpet mount, it's just a pain that the tank's inside the truck and cleaning it out. So this allows for a quick, easy clean out. Um, and then after every job, especially when we get into hazardous waste. We have to do a decon and clean and then uh, rinse the tanks and then all of our fittings and hoses. Um, as you can see the front of the unit. We've got, it's got a pressure washer built into it. Um, you can see the engine. So this is the pump on it. It's actually a lot of you know, a lot of the money for this unit is in the pump, and then it's got a Cummins diesel. Uh, smaller Cummins, but just having the diesel power, so we, we really, we never run out of suction, like suction loss or power, um, having a diesel. And then obviously, too, there's a pressure washer, so we get in situations where backflow explodes, we need to pressure wash, you know, the entire street, right? Um, so that's all nice to have in the same unit. Other retrofits we did, like our emergency lighting, but just some of the smaller stuff like the lighting. Um, and then again, like I'd say, if you're a, so if you're a client, this is a huge value to you. Just in the Bay Area, we have three of these ready to go anytime. If you're a partner, you know, and you're, you own a disaster business, I actually sell, uh, we can get you the whole kit for, to retrofit so you can get the reels, you can get all your fittings. Um, you know, this is a cam fitting for the dump, for the dump valve, and we can also, we can set you up with the lights and how, you know, show you how to wire those up. 
and I actually get in in my closed group I get into more detail on like you know how you can spend a minimal amount of money setting yourself up with the with the reels the hose and then all your cam locks and then literally you can just call United Rental and rent this thing out for I mean I think they probably rent for 500 to 1000 a day I think we build close to like 1200 a day uh, to use it and that's without offer that's with the operator right um, the only other thing you're going to need is a you know a dually or heavy duty diesel to tow it cuz it's a 10,000 pound trailer um, so anyways, we'll let these guys get back to prepping the unit, and thanks for tuning in.